I need to say something. Listen to me. I hope every one of you behind the screens on this arena can feel this level of happiness just one time in your life. I hope all of you can feel how happy I am just one time in your life. But guess what? You will never feel this level of happiness if you don't go for something in your own life. When they knock you down, when they try and get on you, when they talk about you, and they try to put their foot on your neck, if you stay down, you will never ever get that result. Fortify your mind and feel this level of happiness as you rise. One time in your life when I'm blessed to be able to feel this again and again and again and again and again. Hello. What does Israel Adesanya mean? They put their foot on your neck and they try to bring you down. He's fueling himself with the disbelief others possess of him. In essence, it is the delay of gratification armed with self-belief which helps his positive motivation. That is just it. He's committing himself to a process and all of it fuels him and just thinking about that bottle of water while you get thirstier and thirstier when it does finally happen, boom, euphoria. You finally got what you wanted. You are filled with not just relief. You finally got what you wanted. The reward center of your brain, it fills you with euphoria. Sitting in tension until the task is done. That's what we need more of. In the age of stimulation, constant rushes, our reward center of the brain has no appreciation for that tension, for the struggle. There is no meaning without it, thus the bottle of water will feel meaningless all the same. Thus, being unmotivated, feeling little if not no positive motivation, it is the end result. When you understand, you realize in conclusion that the restraint and discipline regardless of what the world says, these are the secrets to Israel Adesanya's happiness. Restraint and discipline. When you have those, you can live in bliss over and over again, while still building a world for yourself. Just like Israel Adesanya. To that end, thank you, Israel Adesanya, for this lesson.